up in the drip when I splash, yeah. Ain't got time to chat, yeah. I'm running to the back. Hold up, can't chat. Run it up, run it up. What's going on, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls? Back at it again with another reaction video. Today, we're gonna get into blind channel trigger. Yes, you guys requested this one quite a bit um, after my last blind channel song, so we're gonna hop right into it. But before we do, make sure you hit that subscribe button with those notification bells so you don't miss a single video. And then up here, I have all my social media that I'm most active on. Yes, I make music, Spotify, Pandora, Google Play, Apple Music, wherever you listen to music, I'm there. Search your boy up. Links for that in the description down below. Click on it. Come say what's up to your boy. Also, I will leave a card right here for music videos that I've done if you want to see my music videos. Um, got to that pretty quick. So, with all of that out of the way, hope you guys are having a good one. Come by with your boy. This has like a Pantera Metallica kind of vibe from the 80s. This is a different Blind Channel song. I like this cadence right here. Vocals right there, nice. Dance, you rebels. What is happening? I like the the different conversations they have in the background. Oh, the voices are still there. Okay, um, wow, this one was different. This was very different. I don't think this was off their Violent Pop album. Um, Blood Brothers, I guess it might be. Um, okay, so, wow, this one was different. This must have been before they got Alexi. So, it had, what's unique about this song is it had like four different styles of music in it, I feel like. It had that Metallica, Pantera kind of vibe from the 80s. Um, it had an aggressive part to it. Then it had kind of like a rock, just like a chill rock with more melody in it. Um, and the, the transitions were very abrupt. So that's what I mean by this song was unique and it was, it was different. It was the transitions from those styles were just like night and day. There was, there was no, no um, pre-notes or pre tempo change or anything like that to kind of guide you into that transition it just switched so it was it was just uh hard to kind of catch a vibe because i would i would 
get to it, I'd vibe, and then it would switch, and it was so abrupt. I was like, what's going on? It was it was very, um, not chaotic, because there was a clear path that they took on these transitions, and they repeated it throughout the, the uh, song. There was continuity to it. There was a pattern. But it was just so out of the blue. I'm not used to it. Um, it's a very different method of transitioning um because it's it's very hard and abrupt so i will say the vocals um when on the chorus when you you know pull that trigger and he does that high note fantastic and then they blend some other melody vocals in the background like some uh, harmonies in the background on top of the vocals i guess i underneath the vocals in the background and uh that part is very nice and then the guitar part, there was a little bit of a solo, almost a solo. It was it was like a mini solo. That's a little different for Blind Channel as well. That's something that you see mainly in like rock music, classical, not classical, but like 80s rock music obviously was the thing to do uh, guitar solos. And then today you find a lot of that in like heavier metal. So for Blind Channel specifically, that was kind of um, unique too, to have a little guitar solo in there. And it wasn't a full out guitar solo, but it was it was a little miniature one. Um, and then I liked the cadence on the drums part. That was a very like aggressive marching kind of forward pace that they had going on there. Overall though, this was this was one of those songs that's so different from what I'm used to for the band that I need to go back and listen to it a few times. To really kind of see what they were doing and and kind of understand the switch ups in the the style that they did the song because as of right now it's it's it didn't really hit me I didn't really vibe with it too much because it's different um, and so it ranks a little bit lower on my personal list of Blind Channel songs but. It's also an older song too, so it could have been when they're going through like an experimental phase, which is great for any band or artist to go through experimental phases to really fine tune your sound or find new sounds and new styles. Like it's it's if you don't have an artist or band that experiments, they're never gonna grow. You know, they're gonna stay stagnant. So, anyways, um, overall, yeah, as far as vibes, not too sure about this one. Didn't really vibe with it. I'm going to have to give it a few more listens and try to dissect it. It's such a unique song. But as far as like the structure of the song, it was very interesting. Um, it was pretty cool to have like three or four different styles kind of mashed up and then really abruptly transition. That's something that I don't think I've really heard before. Um, and overall, I mean, obviously the, the technical aspects of it are good. You know, the drums are good. Guitar was good. Nothing special. Nothing stood out like crazy. Um, the little guitar solo kind of caught my eye and or my ear, and then so did the vocals on the chorus when they uh, went a little bit more melodic. So, yeah, different song. But uh, that'll do it for today's reaction video. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, leave a like, uh, drop a comment down below. It helps the algorithm, helps the channel grow. All the YouTube things that YouTube does. Um, if you're new here, consider subscribing. We're about to hit 9K subs, heading on to that 10K real soon. If you're not new here, welcome back. I appreciate the love and support. As always, thank you guys for showing up and showing love. You guys are awesome. Um, you know what to do. Leave some comments in the comment section down below. Let me know what new bands, artists, genres, songs, whatever you want me to get into. That comment section is for y'all. So, with all of that out of the way, I hope you're having a great day. I'm sending positive vibes your way. And until next time. I'm out. Let's get this back. I tower over these rappers just like the Eiffel. I'm probably in the scope of inner scope, not talking rifles. My competition's depressing, I really got no rivals. They only start dissing me when they feeling suicidal. Someone check the vitals. I'm going places with my brothers like wings. This my martial matters flow. It be going through changes. I've been growing and changing.